Hello everyone, welcome back. This is Cars and Cloud. This is the second video that I create to cover a Groove for Music. So Groove for Music for Windows 10. As you can see here, um, I have Grooves open and if I go to my music, I don't have anything listed under music. Songs, artists, albums. So now we can add music by clicking on the music and then show us where to look for music. And also I don't have any playlists that I created here. So now go ahead and, and uh, get started by clicking on show us where the music is. Build your collection from your local music files. So click on add a folder so you can import your music from your computer. If I click on MP3, the parent um, folder, all the subfolders will be imported as well. So I'm not going to import all the folders. I'm just going to select Paul Wall and I'm going to select Foreigner. And I'm going to select done. So it's importing the music from Paul Walls and from Foreigner. So it should be importing. I have two songs in that one songs each folder. So I have two total of two songs. Still importing. I got Old Girl Paul Wall, I'm waiting for another song. Let's click back. Okay, that's correct. All right, so as you can see here, I have two songs and the artists, I have Foreigner and Paul Wall. And for albums, I have Foreigner and Paul Wall with his uh, pictures and the Foreigner, the picture is wrong. So what I can do is I'm going to just say if I play this song, it's going to play this guy's pictures. As you can see here, it, it's playing his pictures. So if I want to change his picture, all I have to do is just click on Edit Info. I can find the the information about the album from the internet by clicking on Find Albums Info. Or I can click on the little pencil icon here to make the change. And I can choose any pictures I want to change. And just say if I click on Find Album Info, it's going out to Groove Catalog, which is located on the internet. It's called a, a metadata. And as you can see here, it founds related songs, a related um, information for this song. I'm going to select and go to finish. As you can see now, the icon has changed. And this one's also changed the icon. So there is no pictures for this foreigner. And if I want to change to regular pictures, I just have to go in, click edit, and choose the pictures I want to change. Just say if I choose this guy. It will change. I have to um, I have to re-import by going to the music here and click on foreigner remove and then add it back for now where is it f here it is
I should change the picture. Um, I thought I changed it. Let's try again. Yeah, anyway, that's how you change. I'm not sure. Um, you probably had to close the groove and go back in. So that's how you change album pictures um, for your music. All right, so if you want to add more picture, uh, more um, music, you can just go ahead and click on the add and and then um, add folder button. So next, you can look at the recent plays, recent play songs in here, and the now playing. As you can see, it's playing foreigner, and also playlist. I can create playlist. Just say create new playlist. Paul Wall. And then click on create playlist. So I have a playlist called Paul Wall and I have a playlist called um, 80s music. And then click on create. So each of these playlists, I can drag and drop songs I want, or I can rename, pin to start, pin to start, I mean it's going to put an icon here, somewhere in the start button, or I can delete. Let's say if I want to add songs to this 80s music, all I have to do is just go into, go to album, and select the song I want to add to. As you can see. Let's try again. Oh, so you click on it and then go to add to 80s music. Now go back to my 80s music. Here it is. Now if I want to add more songs, I just click on the playlist again. And then go to... So if, actually, if I want to add more song, I just have to go to music, um, select the music I want, and just drag and drop. Just say if I want to drop this one to the 80s. As you can see here, I just added Paul Wall to the 80s music, but it's not 80s. I'm going to delete from the playlist by right-clicking on it, and then go to delete from playlist. And if I want to delete the playlist I just click on the playlist and go to the lead playlist that's it um, if I want to edit the song just right click on the song and then go to edit info if the song title is wrong I can change that here and you know whatever you want to change you can just update the information and then click on save So again, go to music, go to albums, you can change, you can add, add new playlists or add to the existing playlists. And if you have Spots, um, Spotify account, you can um, add it to your, to the group of music by click on get specify, uh, Spotify and then log in with your credentials. So that's all there is to it. Um, just music that you add, recent play, now playing, playlist. You can add and delete playlists. Just say if I want to add um, the parent folder, all I have to do is just click on add. I'm going to add all the, everything under MP3. Just click on MP3. Add. As you can see, it's adding all the songs from the parent folder, MP3. 
So it take a while, so depending on the number of music you have. So again, um, it's easy to change the icon. All you have to do is just right click on it and then go to edit info and change the album information there. That's it. Um, thank you for watching. If you like the video, please don't forget to subscribe and have a wonderful day.